welcome to eyes open fx so from the continuation of our series if you have been following up and it has been properly arranged now so that you can understand everything we have been doing all right so the first thing we're talking about today is uh, what is break of what structure so what is break of structure so break of structure is when market break a swing point either high or low to make a new high or low depending on the trend now we uh, from the previous series we were able to understand what we call bullish and bearish all right bullish and bearish trend so we said when market is creating series of what up move we call it a bullish move series of what swing points to the downside we call it a bearish move all right so that is the idea of our uh bullish and what bearish trend so today we'll be explaining what we call a break of structure so bos means break of what structure that is the simple idea of what break of structure so now we'll be explaining them now what makes a break of structure there are majorly two things that makes a break of structure so we have high and we have a low all right these are the two things that make what that makes structure a high and a low that is all so the idea or the narrative is how you can actually combine it for it to rhyme depending on the trend all right so now let's say for example in a bullish trend market is creating a higher high a higher low 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 a higher high now this area is a high why because it's in a bullish trend this is a low a high a low a high a low a high and a new low before market formed a new high here now the idea behind it is that this high this high is higher than this low that's why we call it a high all right so because it's a high when market break the high of it we call it break of structure when market break this high this is what we call a break of structure all right so as market break this high we call it a break of what structure it broke a swing point we're able to understand what we call a swing point so when market break this high we call it what a break of structure now this is a low this high is higher than this former high and also higher than this little uh higher than this low so we call it what a higher high so that means this is a higher high compared to the previous high that was formed then why this is also what a higher high a higher high a higher high all right so why do we call all these swing points a higher high we call them a higher high because they are what higher than the previous high so this is a higher high this one is higher than this one that's why it's called a higher high this one is higher than this one that's why it's called a higher high this one is higher than this one that's why it's called a higher high this is the idea of simple structure right this is the beginning of smc that you need you just need to what understand so this is what a low all right this is also a low compared to this high this is a low compared to this high but this low is a high compared to this low all right the formal low that was formed around this area that we did not actually mark all right because it's a bullish trend this is higher than that all right so that means this will become automatically this will become your what higher low this one will become your what higher low a higher low a higher low all right this is the idea of what structure so this is the higher low why because it's what higher than the formal low but it's still a low compared to this high this is a higher low because this low is higher than this one that's why it comes first a high 
then low why because it's what lower than this high here the same thing applies to this the same thing applies to this so this is what makes what a bullish trend so this is what we call what a bullish trend so this is our what our bullish trend so this is what makes what a bullish trend so as market makes a new higher high which is around this area we call it a break of structure we call it what break of structure so this is our what our break of structure this is our break of what structure this is our what break of what structure so same idea this is what for a bullish trend this is what a bullish trend now let's explain uh, a bearish trend move so this is a bearish trend market is making string point low string point low string point low in a particular downtrend direction all right so this is a swing point low this is a swing point high a swing point low a swing point high now what what will we call this this is a low compared to this high so that means the first thing that will come here is a low all right a low now there will be or there was what a formal low here before so because this low is lower than that formal low we call this low a lower low we call this low lower low this low a lower low so that means because this low is lower than this low and it's also lower than this high so that means this low is also what a lower low the same thing applies here because this low is lower than this low and it's also lower, also lower than this high here so that means is what a lower low lower low this is the idea of structure all right so when market break this low we call it what a break of structure we call this break of structure in what in a bearish trend so it break this low we call it what break of structure again for what bearish trend it break this low the same thing a break of what structure so now this is what makes a structure so now we have this high swing point high swing point high now what can you actually call it you will call it what because it's in a downtrend it become a low all right because it's in a downtrend it will become it will first have that name low in a downtrend a low but it's higher than this low so that means it's what is what a lower high this high is what lower high the same thing with this a lower high why because it's lower it's higher than this low here this low is lower than the formal low that's why they're called lower low this high this high here is what higher than this low that's why it's called what a lower high it's first come out as a lower low why because it's what in a downtrend and it's lower than this formal low in this uh, this formal high here that's why it calls what a lower high that is the idea of what structure this one we also call what a lower high why because the same thing is lower than this formal high here but it's still in the downtrend so and it's what higher than this low so that's why it's called a lower high this is what makes a simple structure in what a bullish or a bearish trend so now let's see it on a chart so on this chart you can actually agree with me now based on what we're actually seeing here you can actually agree with me that this is what a low a high right a low a high a low a high 
so you can actually define this move here as what a bearish trend so since it's a bearish trend when market makes a new lower low we call we will call this a break of structure in a bearish move a break of structure in a bearish move the same thing here a break of structure in a bearish move same here a break of structure in a bearish move so since we have this as what a break of structure so this is what makes a trend all right so these ones will be answering now a lower low a lower high a lower low just according to the what the thing that we sketched on the chart lower high lower low lower high and the recent lower low right so that's just it so this is what we call a down trend now let's see example of what an uptrend so when you look at this chart here now neglect about what happened neglect what happened here back so from this vertical blue line back so we we'll focus on what is happening here in this upside so you are seeing that market is actually creating a high a low a high a low a high a low this is what we call a bullish trend so market created a higher high here this will be now a bus right break of structure to the upside the same thing the same thing a break of structure to the upside the same thing here a break of structure to the upside so this is break of structure so this will become now a higher high higher low higher high higher low higher high and a higher low before market from this recent higher high so this is our higher low here so let's put them where they belong now this is a simple structure that you have to understand i'm actually doing everything here on the chart with you all right so now this is a higher high a higher low a higher high a higher low a higher high a higher low this symbolizes a bullish trend with what the idea of what a break of structure this symbolizes what to call a bullish trend so this is what makes a bullish trend why what you're seeing here is what makes what a bearish trend so you can actually see both of them on same chart so there is the idea between uh bullish and bearish trend and what structure with the aid of what bos to understand a bullish and a bearish trend so that is all so remain blessed and uh share with your family and subscribe turn on your notification as we will be also be dropping some other series apart from this series because we are already getting to the what uh climax of this what series so good luck god bless you